with the purpose of stimulating and inspiring the learning of chemistry among students, as well as raising the IQ. PZ Carson Foundation organized the fifth edition of PZ Carson Chemistry Challenge, Nigeria's number one pure science competition. The competition, which is divided into four stages, challenged the IQ of contestants in general tests, practical tests, and the life quiz. In which of the following compounds does chlorine exhibit an oxidation state of minus one? A. Zinc chloride, that's ZnCl2, NaOCl, C. KClOC, and 4 HOCl. Your answer, please. Final answer. The answer is A. A round of applause, please. In which of the following oxides does nitrogen have the oxidation number of plus one? A. KFO3. B. N2O. C. N2O3. And D. NO. B. N2O. Final answer. A round of applause, please. Successful candidates from each of the stages progress to the next stage and finally the best six candidates battled it out at the grand finale. Which of the following is true of elements as one moves from left to right across a period of the periodic table? A. Electronegativity increases, atomic radius increases. B. Electronegativity decreases, atomic radius increases. C. Electronegativity increases, atomic radius does not change. And D. Electronegativity increases, atomic radius After a keenly contested competition, Fatai Tadeshi, a student of Abibat Mogaji, Millennium Senior Secondary School, emerged winner, taking home the star prize of a trophy, a medal, and one million naira. There were also additional prizes, including laboratory equipment for schools and teachers who came out top in the teacher's aptitude test segment. The Permanent Secretary, Ministry of Education, Mrs. Adebumi Adekonye, commended the organizers for supporting the education sector through the competition. This is the fifth edition of the Cousins PZ Chemistry Competition. Last year, we were second. second. This year, we are first, third, and fifth. And that means a lot to us. It means we have buckled up. It means we are going places. It means public schools are as competitive as any that you can find out there. And we're excited and happy about it. You can see the prizes that we're giving to them. It means chemistry is life. It means with chemistry you can go places. It means studying hard will fetch you a reward. And we are happy that all the other students are seeing the rewards of hard work. The winner of the Star Prize and his teacher expressed their joy. I am very great and I am very grateful to God for giving me this opportunity for my achievements. And obviously, there is no, there's no secret except God. He's the one that gives me the grace. So I am grateful for him. I prepared very well. My teacher helped me. He was the one mentoring me. And he gave me the courage to win this competition. My advice to other young chem students is they should face chemistry as a, as a weak subject. It's a very broad subject, but it's a very good subject. When we started it we never knew that we could even go this far our first round we didn't really do too well but the second round we improved then on the third round the practical was fantastic and thank god for what happened here it has been great we're able to emerge as a overall winner which has never happened in public school before and doing this uh, making this mark i'm very very thankful i'm very very thankful to god for what he has done to us because it's not our power not by my but it's by his grace but made it possible for us. The 2018 edition of the PZ Carson Chemistry Challenge was indeed exciting as the relevance of chemistry to the society was also demonstrated.